Hey everyone, this is Day Trader Rockstar, and this is the market radar for April 17th. That is going to be a Thursday, last day of the week before a Easter holiday. And um, again, this is a uh, an interesting setup. Uh, yesterday we called for a two hour two arrow up rally, representing you know a pretty much a high probability setup for an upside push, and that's exactly what we got today. So very happy with the results. Um, this this call was really based off of a technical setup. It was basically the the daily stochastics, the 60 minute uh, stochastics, which just crossed over, and the overall pattern. And you know, like I said, there is news that overhangs this market, and I had to decide if that news was, you know, a, a big enough event to really just kind of uh, discount this great pattern that was setting up. We had a nice one, two, three pattern earlier in the week. Identified a great level here. We actually bounced up there. Looked like we were going to fail, then reversed. Once we got past to this point up here, everything started looking good. We started getting embedded. We talked about the embedded stochastics continuation. But the crossover here, this is where it all started. Um, the nice crossover in the daily. Going back to the daily, um, just crossing over. And again, uh, continue to show you the history of this market and this type of setup that's been very, um, I should say, very consistent, very reliable everything else looking pretty good so it looks like a continuation of the same thing so going into tomorrow we have a funny uh, another uh, situation we had some earnings out after the close we had google come out and miss earnings and get slammed after hours not a tr tremendous slam but considering it was up 20 points uh before earnings came out it was up 20 po points on the day looking at uh post market trade right now it's down 17 so it looks like it's down about 37 dollars and that's going to put a little pressure on the nasdaq tomorrow i could tell you right now S&P futures only down three i think nasdaq futures down four and change and this is going into about 11 o'clock and i again apologize for the late um market report i promised i always get it out between 4 30 and 5 but i had uh, some obligations i had to take care of i just did not uh was not able to do it but i am dedicated enough to get it out here so i want to make sure we make a, a you know a call for tomorrow Everything continues to look pretty good. The big, the big thing is again last day of the week. Um, you know, how does the earnings play, or the earnings play into this Google's um, so-called miss? I don't. You know, it's. I didn't read into the report too much. I was not around after hours, so I have to uh, dig a little deeper. But I do see it's down about 17 points uh, post market or you know after market, and that should. Put a little pressure on some of the tech stocks. Uh, you know, a consolidation at this point wouldn't be that bad. It wouldn't be that unhealthy. So, you know what? I want to make it short and sweet and get this out. You know, due to the, you know, the potential smackdown between some, um, you know, maybe some, uh, you know, the Nasdaq dragging us down. You know, I'm going to I'll give this a one arrow down, down day tomorrow, and more look for at least a little consolidation and and. Um, you know, just uh, maybe an inside day, maybe a little further downside, but at least I'm looking for a down day tomorrow. A little tougher call. Um, I like the overall pattern, but, um, you know, I do consider this pattern to be a good pattern. We're going to actually move higher. Just a little concerned about what the earnings, what the pre-holiday uh, market's going to do tomorrow. And uh, maybe we might have a kind of a muted day and maybe even a down day tomorrow. So putting that out there, one arrow down, and um, we're going to pick this up tomorrow. I'll be in the uh, room with you guys trading all day and we're going to be treated like a friday so um that's that's about it other than that i you know going for you know just one note on this um if the market actually uh you know ends up discounting the uh, the uh, google earnings and continues to move higher at least move even you know move into positive territory you know it's going to show some good strength we had a you know a pretty good three-day rally so there's we're kind of due to get a little pullback. Um, so I wouldn't be surprised to see that kind of shake out, fake out later in the day. Definitely looking at a one arrow down day tomorrow. We'll see you in the markets. I'm out. Day Trader Rockstar. And we'll talk to you then.